so there's a bit of an update here for Bleach, right? So this is a very interesting turn of events. So uh, the last time we talked about Bleach on a main episode, it was like brief. We just brought it up to hype up the Patreon episode. What was that? What you doing the, I'm doing the- Oh shit! <laughs> I was like, hold on. But okay. <laughs> But okay, I'll just get into. I'll just say it. And Brandon doesn't even realize this. I just I can see it on his face. He has no idea what the fuck I'm about to say. And it's not it's not that it's not that big of a deal to be honest. But here we go. It's funny. So Brandon, um, Bleach is coming out this fall, right? What app do you think we're gonna be using to watch it? Uh, I mean, either Crunchyroll or Animation. You would think, or Funim Funimation. Would you think. would think. You, you would think. think. Now, now, what if you didn't think? If I didn't think, <laughs> I would say probably Hulu and or Netflix. Or YouTube TV. Well, no, it's not even. No way. Take, it, take it to the next level. Disney? <laughs> <laughs> ding, ding, ding! Yo, look at it. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't even got a Disney fucking account, bro. Yeah, we do. You do. No, no, no. Well, we unless, we do. Unless, unless He's that. going back there. Yeah. We we have What the fuck is Bleach on Disney? Okay, so let me explain. All right? So this better um, be good. And shout out to shout out to the homie James Hansen, right? I don't know if you guys know who James Hansen is, but he is a Bleach content creator. He's like he is the geekdom of Bleach, I think, right? He's the Bleachdom. The Bleachdom. Oh. Right? So he got Bleach on lock. And he reported, he did a video actually that came out today that I actually saw while I was eating uh, breakfast, I think. Yeah. I was having some breakfast and I put that John on and it was like a 15 minute, very informative video, had his opinions in there as well. But you know, who doesn't have those, right? I do the same shit in mine. And he was going over the official news. It's not a rumor no more. Disney now has the rights to stream Bleach on their fucking app. And the crazy part about that is that they, it was a, there was a bidding war, okay? And <laughs> Crunchyroll, it was a bidding war, yes. Cause in the field of business, it's all about who wants to pay the top dollar. And Crunchyroll lost. How the fuck does Crunchyroll <laughs> lose? Bro. I mean, I know Disney is a big fucking corporation. But when like, Disney wants something. Bro, get Disney out of here, bro. Why? why bro, bro, wait, 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 wait. Wait till Disney finds out Dragon Ball is bigger. Oh, son. <laughs> no, no, no. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold bro, on, bro, so. bro, bro. Keep Disney on Disney. Facts. Anime it's is too anime. Late. Funimation or Crunchyroll. Listen. Now listen. we got Disney made, bro. Cool. Get with the times. Bro, it's too late. Listen, what? listen, listen, listen. I know this is going to cause a whole... They just trying to get niggas to, to fucking subscribe and shit. But yep, it, that's exactly listen, what they're doing. Listen, okay, right, right? As, as a streaming platform, you clearly want to have content on it to get people to subscribe, to buy uh, into it. Clearly, it makes sense. Disney they stole Bleach. They, <laughs> wait, <okay>. they paid <laughs> for it. They paid for it. All right, and they steal it. All right. Mickey Mouse said, "Oh, oh here's a million jillion dollars." Oh, what? <laughs> oh, 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 fuck your country roll. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's what happened, bro. That's, that's, that's what, literally what happened. That's what happened, bro. That's what fucking happened. Like no joke. So the thing is. And here's and here's and here's the part that you're I think Brandon you're gonna you might find a little bit interesting. When you so James Hansen he did the breakdown of like how they look at the overall scope of the trajectory of like how many people realistically will watch a certain show on a platform. And and we're talking numbers here. So I'm gonna like I'm, I might butcher this a little bit, but like you guys should hopefully understand like where I'm you know the premise of this. So if you take all of the subscribers that exist on Crunchyroll, right? There's going to be, take take 10% of however many people that is, right? And then take 
like another 10% under out of that 10%. And that's how many people are realistically watching. Like they're paying their subscription for a specific show. And that's what they're watching and only for that, right? So now take Disney, Disney Plus. And the same, the same figures, right? 10%. And then another 10% of that 10%. That 10% is way bigger than a Crunchyroll 10%. So by that, figuratively, Bleach being on Disney Plus is going to have more eyes. And it's going to do way more. <laughs> he doesn't like that. It's going to do way more for that anime and in turn, effectively, it's going to positively affect anime overall. Because here's the thing. Bleach is, fact, going to do successful. I don't understand <laughs> due to reasoning. If you're, if you're trying to lay down these numbers and shit, it sounds like crunch, or it sounds like these motherfuckers took some data in Crunchyroll. Because I don't even know if Disney even has the OG Bleach. But it sounds like this war is about how many viewers, like out of whatever percentage is used, of how of how many people are actually watching Bleach. Like, how are you gonna take old data from how many niggas is watching Bleach currently now and no, then no, no, use no, no, that no, no, to no. vote? I don't think that's the point he's trying to no, make. No, that's I think not. That's the a point. separate. I think that's a separate thing. He's just saying that like for Disney Plus, the show be like the show of Bleach being on Disney Plus <clears throat> versus Crunchyroll will do better numbers statistically because However, more people have subs to because disney. more people have subs to disney plus there even it if is. it's yeah even if we don't like it that's that's just how it's gonna go right but they still that that's still I bro don't, country you, took nobody the biggest to L, that. bro because that that's... shit is dry as fuck nobody nobody's on Crunchyroll right now unless you watch an old shit like i can't bro i can't find nothing i haven't watched uh, anime in fucking months <laughs> That's to a be personal honest, problem because it is a personal you... <laughs> problem. Because these motherfuckers are dry as fuck right now. That's that's, that's not my problem at that point. It's their also, problem. They so got here's, an, the, here, here's another shit. factual piece of information though that I also got from James Hansen because I mean I could have seen this anywhere else, but I saw it on his video, so I'm gonna keep plugging him. Did you know that Disney Plus has surpassed Netflix? No. Well, now you do. So that should give you a grander scope of how much bigger of a deal this is that a, in a singular anime, and it's not just any anime, okay? They could have done it with anything, but they they got Bleach, okay? They got one of the big three. Exactly. Yeah, that, that's what that, that, that was a they good business move on shit. them, but God, like, they, they ruined yeah. the culture, bro. No, 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 don't be, don't, listen, don't do that, okay? You don't want to be ignorant. Okay, because the thing is, Disney Plus is not just a streaming service for cartoons. Okay, the service as it as a whole has shit from like National Geographic, the cartoons, Marvel, a lot of original shit. It's not just the fucking cartoons. And let me get technical with you, little brother. Okay, <laughs> anime is Japanese cartoons ah there it is right the thing that a lot of people don't want to fucking acknowledge but that's what it is at the end of the day a cartoon is animated and anime the only difference is that like it's the style like, japanese cartoons it's were not meant bro. for kids it's different bro it's different it is different it's very different there's clearly there's look 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 I'm not saying that Spongebob is on the fucking same level as fucking Dragon Ball Z or, you know, there's different styles. But at the end of the day, they are all animated works. They are all drawn, whether it's by hand or digitally, okay? This is a fact. And that is what anime is. Anime is Japanese cartoons, Japanese animation. It is a style. Okay, so the fact that Bleach is the first one to be on Disney Plus is huge because this is going to do a huge number for anime as a whole because they took probably the best thing possible that's currently going on that's 
available because they could have took Boruto. They could have they they, they could have took like a, I don't know like Attack Ain't on nobody. Titan or they could have took Chainsaw Man. Anything that's upcoming, nah. They in the bidding war they got themselves the new and upcoming highly anticipated bleach wait a minute though what how much money do you think they have left what are you talking about like how much money they have left because like like, like they, they, they got extra change to get something else <laughs> uh-huh because you know uh what's gonna happen next year oh super well there you go there you go because this is see and this is the thing right and I say this all the time with video games. When you have something that, like, let's say you have, like, an older franchise that's, like, popular, you know, it's, it's loved by the fans and whatever, but there's no sequel. There's no second, third, whatever iteration, and the fans want it. Well, what sometimes happens with a lot of developers, not all the time, but sometimes they will release a collection. And a collection will include that old game and anything that might tie in with it or relate to it or whatever. Now, that collection is used as a feeler, okay? It's used as a test. So that way people, the, the, the company can gauge, oh wow, this is doing really well. And part of that reason is because this is in that collection. So what does that do that for the company? That means, there's money here to be made. So therefore, the chances, it's not a guarantee, but the chances of a sequel or another iteration rises up. The same thing happens in Dragon Ball Z. Look what happened with Battle of Gods. That was a test. If that movie flopped, we would not have Super. Facts. Okay? If that movie flopped, we would not have Super. If Broly was never a popular fucking character all throughout his why am I hating on Kakarot days for no fucking reason. He was crying right next to me. How do I remember this? I don't know. During those days, if he was not popular, they would never have been in Toriyama's ear and been like, yo, you should bring, you should bring in Broly. Fact. This is real shit. I bring all this up because Bleach being the first big fucking acquisition for Disney Plus, bro, is going to be their measuring stick. They're gonna be like, here's Bleach. Here's how good it's doing. The numbers are all fucking through the roof and past the clouds. Everybody's loving it because it's fucking Bleach. Bro, Bleach is back. You understand? Back again, once again. How many years have we waited? Ask him. Ask dad. Dude, when I came over there over the Christmas break and I showed y'all that trailer, this man popped off harder than Brandon. He said, oh, yes, I knew it. I knew it. He was hype. That is almost hitting 60. Hey, my man is hype for fucking Bleach. Now take that. Everybody's fucking hyped for Bleach, bro. That's been the most anticipated, highly requested fucking series. So for a second, you don't think people are gonna fucking hop over to Disney Plus to go watch that shit? Absolutely the fuck they are. You kidding me? That shit's gonna be successful. It's gonna do a great number, and it's only going to enable them to acquire more. Bleach is gonna be the first fucking anime in the anime category, leading the shit, and it's gonna have a nice seat for Goku and the gang. You watch. You watch. Yeah, yeah the the it way really this is. shit is the way this shit is like being constructed, it sounds like Crunchyroll and or Funimation or anybody else is never gonna get another <laughs> fucking anime again. Unless it's fucking shit. Because Disney, it sounds like they're just gonna buy every fucking thing. And they're just going to take over and then Crunchyroll Funimation are going to shut down. Hulu might even shut down because they got no fucking anime. And then, <laughs> and you and then, tell me that they're not going to jump on that shit. Disney already has their hands on Marvel and we know who loves Marvel. Right. Even make fucking you know how much more convenient it's going to be for Toyotaro and Toriyama to fucking... Bro, 
They're gonna be bro, drawing like, this shit with Disney Plus right there. That's what I'm saying. Bro, they're gonna have to, like, Funimation and Crunchyroll are gonna have to fucking merge to compete with Disney or, or some shit. Like, real talk. Bro, Crunchyroll they, already acquired they, Funimation. They, they, they oh, they did? did? They oh, absorbed yeah. Funimation oh. already, yes. Phase they, one's oh. been complete. Exactly. Yeah, they fucked up. They, they're, gonna have to, they're gonna have to merge with fucking Netflix and Hulu then. Oh, they're gonna. <laughs> Yo. Dude, they're gonna have to fuse. <laughs> Disney Plus is the Thanos. And everyone else is just like a fucking Avenger. Not even at this rate, because they're gonna need a lot. Oh, that's that good shit! <laughs> <laughs>